All right, so I am back with the next morning and we are actually going to start by trying for a baby. <laughs> First thing in the morning. Um, no, I'm sorry, dad. We're not talking with you right now. Sorry. Uh, yeah, we're gonna let them try for a baby. I think Zane, oh, Zane's awake. Okay, never mind. Uh -huh. I think he's still sleeping, but no, he is not. He is awake. Go pee, puppy. <laughs> okay, so we got Disney Plus. My brother, like, I've, don't get me wrong, I wanted it, but my brother was the one that actually managed to talk my parents into getting it, and I mean, yeah, I've been watching a lot of movies, but I've just been watching Zootopia, <laughs> like, over and over. I've watched Big Hero 6 a few times, I've watched Wally a few times, those are like, we're pregnant. Um, those are probably like three of my all-time favorite Disney movies. And Curlins, or Hallmark, I guess, they don't go by Curlins anymore, um, has a flash ornament from Zootopia not like flash the superhero flash the sloth for any of you who have seen Zootopia know who I'm talking about and I saw it I'm like I have to get this I don't care if I have no money <laughs> I, I just I had to get it um it's one that it talks he only says one line sadly but uh it's him and Nick talking and so you know Nick goes, hey, hey, Flash, you want to hear a joke? Sure. What do you call a three-humped camel? I don't know. What do you call a three-humped camel? Pregnant. Ha, ha, ha. 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 <laughs> like, I just had to have it. So, actually, the, f the one that I got was broken. We brought it home. It wouldn't work. So, then we had to go exchange it for a new one. This one, thankfully, works. But, yeah. What are you doing? What's his problem? Hunger and social. Well, if you want to take care of him, Davin, you be a good dad and you go take care of him. Uh, we will change his outfit. We'll attack him with a claw. Snuggle. Feed him on the floor. Then we'll let you go get something to eat. Um, I did give Gemina a new hair as well. Hopefully this one won't clip through everything. It shouldn't because... Pretty much all of the hairs on the back. Also, she made apple pancakes. <laughs> and I guess I'm just going to have to wait for them to go bad. Um, because I'm not letting her eat apple pancakes. Because um, I don't want it to sway the gender of the next baby. So. They're just going to have to sit in there. And I don't. I, I guess. Well, I guess. You know what? We will let Davin eat apple pancakes. Oop. I'm being called for. I swear all this part is is me cutting in and out. I'll be right back. Alright. So I just came out of Create a Sim from giving Zane a makeover. And um, I did record it. It will be at the end of the part. But he is not perfect genetics. He has... Uh, Clara's blonde hair, but he has he has the yellow eyes, but blonde hair, not not our pink. So it's not perfect genetics, clearly. Uh, but I'm actually gonna cut back out because I'm just gonna send them all to bed, and um, I'll see you guys in a second. All right. So I have given Onyx his makeover. He looks just like his dad, and he like fittingly has his dad black hair so the name suits him quite well um he's currently just chilling out down here i had Gemina, who is suddenly older why did his age reset um No, that's not right. Ooh, seven. Uh, anyways, 
uh, he, not she, she's gone upstairs. I had her go get some pancakes, pear pancakes, not apple pancakes, um, because she was hungry. And then she's going to come back down here and potty train him. I'm still waiting for Patch to age up. But seeing as how, like, I always take forever to get around to making puppies anymore, um, that's okay. I'm just gonna let them take their own sweet time. Since, like, they have straight access outside, they aren't as annoying as they normally are because I don't have to worry about teleporting them in, in and out and all over the house, so. Um, and I was not quick enough to get her and Davin to try for another baby before he left for work. He was already gone by the time she finally gave birth, so we'll just have to wait for him to get home. It shouldn't take super long. Like, they've actually, like, Zane learned his, his skills, like, really fast. Just kind of cue her up. Does he have his app? Yeah, he does. I had him sign up for a scouting. Or scouting scout. You know, whatever. I told myself I was going to go to work tonight, but then I realized by the time I got home that I was only going to be able to go to work for like an hour and a half, and like I'd get there and get started just to have to turn around and leave. I don't even have anything going on tomorrow. I don't think I do. Uh, I do not. It's like a perfect day to go work. Bark. Oh, yeah, my love when there's just puddles in the middle of the floor from the potty chair. <laughs> oh, and she's so not feeling this. Because it's dirty and she dislikes children. Like, I've gotten used to the past few generations with both Jasper and Caleb, like, always going to work during the day and, you know, having Audra and, and Clara, who are totally fine with kids and teaching them their skills and stuff. And then now I have Gemina. She's like, I hate this. <laughs> kids are awful. cannot see around my mic. So, I believe I've talked about it before, that there's a game that I've played called Heave Ho, and it is with one of my like, closest, I think she actually, at this point, she is my closest friend. And I would love, absolutely love, to record us playing and post it on my gaming channel but the thing is like she doesn't know that I have a YouTube channel and I'm I'm not embarrassed of my YouTube channel at all but I like the person like the one friend that does know like all she did was make fun of me for it which I, I didn't appreciate and I honestly think she's forgotten but wait I don't know. Oh, but it's so much fun playing the game, like playing Hee Ho, and we were trying to play it the other night. But Starbucks was having a happy hour, 
and it ended at 7, and we realized it's like 6.30, so we ran out to Starbucks, came back, and then we decided we were going to go look at lights, because uh, we have this like light display, um, and it's like three minutes from my house that we went to, and stuff like that. And then she left, and I came upstairs, and I see the game still sitting here. I'm like, oh, crap. <laughs> we didn't, like, even get through, like, three levels before. Like, we were we were too busy laughing. Like, we couldn't keep ourselves together. We were cracking ourselves up. Stay home. Nope. Well, well Davin just got home. But I totally recommend that game. Like, find a friend to play it with, and you 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 won't regret it. It is so much fun, but really difficult, at least for me, to play with keyboard. So I use a PS3 controller on the gaming channel because I didn't think I actually had an Xbox, like an extra spare Xbox 360. Or like any kind of Xbox controller, which is what Steam wants me to use. Well, I did find one. And I could have sworn we had an extra, but when I was looking, like before I even started the gaming channel, when I was looking for the extra Xbox, because I could have sworn we had two black ones and my brother has like a camouflaged one. I'm like, I could have sworn we had three. But my dad's like, no, we've always had just two. It's just the two. We don't have any, like, we just have two. And so I'm like, okay, and I mean, I couldn't find one of the black ones, so I'm like, hmm, must have had two, I'm not gonna take one though, cause... So, on the other hand, we have like four PS3 controllers, cause my dad bought it from a friend of his, and they have like three boys, and then they had an extra controller for when they had a friend over or something, and so they could just, they had four controllers, and so I took one of those, and like I've been using that and then I found the extra Xbox controller that I knew we had and tried getting that to work and it, see, it like won't work. It will not work for whatever reason. So I had to get the PS4 controller because I don't have another PS3 cord. So we made it work though. I had her using the PS4 one and whenever I was concentrating really hard, like the, PS, like the PS4 controller has the light on the end of it and she would like shine it in my face to try and distract me. Cause she's amazing. <laughs> she actually, she got a tattoo. Uh, it was yesterday on her ankle. Um, cause she's had a lot of people pass away in her family and it was just, it was like some of them have died from cancer, some of them have passed away in car accidents and so she got a, it was a, like half of it's a heart, the other half is a cancer ribbon and it's got family written in the middle and she got it on her ankle and cause she's older than me, um, she's started to address me as her little sister <laughs> actually. I mean, I'm not that much younger than her, but anyway, she got this tattoo yesterday and she refused to take off the bandage the whole time she was here. And she, uh, she's like, he said I could take it off after an hour, the tattoo artist. I'm like, so why aren't you taking it off? And she's like, well, and she starts to peel off and she's like, no, you know what? I'll just wait till later. Well, later comes and goes. And then she gets home last night and then she sends me a picture of her taking off the bandage. I'm like, are you serious? You couldn't have done this last night when, or like earlier. So I could have seen the tattoo because I don't want to just look at pictures. I want to see like the real, oh, she wants a grilled cheese. She wants, that's why I had her make grilled cheese sandwiches. Cause she wants one from her pregnancy cravings. Did, did I tell him to put, he just put him right back down. Put Onyx in a walker, please. Okay. And we can come put away these. And then we're going to try for a baby. Where is Zane? 
Oh, he's up. Okay. okay. We're gonna stop that. I'm gonna put down your homework. So you can come work on that. I still say that they're like the grilled cheese sandwich. Like the, I think the bread looks fine, but it's the cheese. <laughs> it's the cheese, just a red square in the middle. <laughs> looks more like a giant piece of tomato than it does a piece of cheese. Alright, dude. Oh, right in front of that kid. Mm. Probably not the best place to start making out, but mm, what can you do? <laughs> Way to go, you guys. Why are you out here? You're supposed to stay in the room. I mean, it's not like there's a door there to keep him from going. This is literally just an open space. Nope, I knew I was going to hit the wrong button. This is literally just an open wall. He can leave whenever he wants, but I was still hoping like an invisible wall would keep him in here. I guess not though. I am tired. And my throat hurts because so, uh, like for, how do I say this? So the last two full weeks before finals, we have the eighth graders from one of our local middle schools um, come to the high school, cause I am a high school student. And I am in a graphics class. Graphics is easily one of my favorite classes I've ever taken. I love my teacher, like she's, amazing i love her to pieces and like she relies she relies on me f where uh for a lot like i do a lot um for her class like the class i'm in is called graphics 2 which is basically just print shop work so we get from whether it's other schools within our school we get like stuff when like the city has uh, we've had something called German Fest before so I have a, there's like a lot of German heritage uh, where I live and so like they'll have a German themed event that is honoring Germans and like we'll make the signage and the tickets and all that fun stuff we make theater tickets like we do a whole bunch and I get put in charge of a lot of those things. Well, the last two Fridays before finals week, um, the eighth graders come and they tour the school. Well, I'm in charge, I was put in charge today of the graphics class. Now we had two different activities. My teacher was with the, the activity that involved um, X-Acto knives. Because for whatever reason, um, she decided it would be a good idea to give 8th graders X-Acto knives. And to be honest, they didn't do too bad. Um, I, don't, I can't get my timer to change back to Transformers. But anyways, like, I mean it went pretty well. And then we do something called screen printing. So we take, we take an image in Adobe Illustrator, we print it out on... Um, I, I forgot the word earlier, and now I'm forgetting it again. Um, See-through paper. What is that called? It starts with a T. 
Um, I called it transfer paper, and it's not transfer paper, but it's like, it's it's a see-through film. What's that called? I'm not thinking transportation, and that is definitely not right. Um, but anyways, we print it off on that, then we burn it into a screen, um, we let it sit overnight, the next day we're able to ink it onto t-shirts, so right, instead of doing t-shirts, we were inking it onto pieces of paper, and then heating it, and we were doing our high school mascot, and last year, I was just put, like, I was just working one of the stations of, like, inking stuff, well, today I was actually in charge of moving like the eighth graders through the room, assigning them two tables, and I was shouting the whole time because like it was it was hectic, it was a mess. Like there was one group that delayed the rest of the groups, and then we were behind the rest of the time they were there, um, which was halfway through first period all the way to the end of fifth period, and like it was just it got really messed up and super crazy towards the end because then we didn't have enough time all of a sudden. And we were scurrying to get things done. Things weren't being heated all the way. So kids were getting wet pieces of paper back. And this ink does not come out of clothes. Someone got ink on my sweatshirt that I had intentionally put away. That like I had moved way out of the way. It was nowhere near the ink. And I somehow still managed to get pink ink on it. But I don't know how because I didn't touch the pink ink today. The only ink I was messing with was the purple and the bronze color, so I don't know how I got pink ink on my sweatshirt, and I'm kind of upset because this does not come out of clothes. But I was shouting, directing, um, my mom actually, she's an 8th grade teacher, so she was there, and I'm bossing everyone around, she's like, wow, look at you being all bossy today. I'm like, excuse me, um, my teacher told me to put my bossy hat on, and so I did, and... I was. I was very bossy today, but now my throat hurts because I was shouting so much trying to get them to shut up or at least so that like, they could hear me. But I need to end the part here. My timer has gone off, so thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Sorry for all the cutting in and out at the beginning. Um, it's just, it's been a, it's been a weird couple of days and it's only going to get weirder, so I won't go into detail. But yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye, guys.